seconds from the state capitol. Luxurious comfort is within reach at the Four Points by Sheridan Tallahassee downtown. The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. Remy Lee lost her unborn child Easter Day 2013. She was tricked into taking an abortion pill. John Andrew Weldon is serving a decade in federal prison on product tampering charges. We asked Remy if she felt the sentence was long enough. Are you ever supposed to feel from the person that hurt you the most? It's like the most precious thing away from me. Lee and her family arrived at the state capitol early and spent a day watching the state senate before legislation allowing up to a life sentence for hurting a fetus was debated. And say if you kill that baby, you're going to go to jail for that because you've done this violence against a woman. 25 days, 14 days, Mr. And so the bill passes. Remy says her hope is that other women won't be tricked as she was. I hope even if just one woman gets to hold their baby as a result, then this would all be worth it to me. And her father, Jim, says the ordeal has had an effect on multiple generations. This would have been my mother's first great-grandchild, my wife and I's first grandchild, and we'll always live with this. Remy Lee may have one more trip to make back here to the state capitol to watch the governor sign the legislation. And Remy says if and when the legislation is signed by the governor, she's going to give him a hug. In Tallahassee, I'm Mike Massalindo reporting.